Around 2.13 a.m. on Sunday, the UE Seismic Research Center recorded a 3.5 magnitude earthquake. Just over five hours later, around half past seven, a 5.1 magnitude quake was recorded in the same vicinity, just west of Trinidad, north of the Paria Peninsula. Many in West Trinidad said they felt a quake in Diego Martin, Port of Spain, St. Anne's and Marafal, and as far east as St. Joseph and Barataria. But researcher in engineering seismology at the UE Seismic Research Center, Dr. Ilias Papadopoulos, assured that this is usual activity north of the Paria Peninsula, noting that there are an average of between 2 to even 10 small to large events daily. We don't have any indication that uh, we feel that something larger is to be expected anytime soon. This is actually how it should be. Once every, I don't know, maybe every two weeks or a month, we should have a little bit bigger, larger event that is actually being felt by people. In fact, he noted that the center would be worried if the opposite effect occurs. If I didn't see any earthquakes at all, then I would start worrying. Because that means that the energy is being accumulated on the fault and it is not being released. So having earthquakes is quick release of energy, the system relaxes, starts stressing up again, it will repeat it, it will relax. He added that the center also recently expanded its capability network to record quakes in West Trinidad, noting that it may pick up more activity that may have been previously missed. We have a better capability to record earthquakes compared to three months ago. But that doesn't mean that because we record more small events that we have elevated activity. We're just being able to see it now because of the installation of the new network. And Mr. Papadopoulos also set the record straight, stating that there is no correlation between earthquakes felt and the extra heat being experienced as of recent. It's not like we have cold days and hot days. It's always hot days. Some days are hotter than the others. But there is no correlation between the heat or the cold in the earthquake activity. Sonolala, TTT News.